Hey everyone, welcome back to Dark Souls Daughters of Ash. We are back in the Undead Asylum, uh, which we returned to. Before I realized that really, the Asylum Demon is actually dead in this one, right? Or something like that. Still, I kind of promised that I would explore the rest of this area. Um, the biggest reason why is because... The alternative is going to the Bed of Chaos, which is not really something I want to do. And there's a treasure there, which I didn't know was there. We'll get it. We'll pick it up. Uh, Ring of the Sun's Firstborn. I assume it does the same thing, which I don't have a second ring. Shit. Yeah, boost miracle power. Uh, we're going with... What did I have? I used to have the hawk ring, right? Fuck it, we'll keep the hawk ring. I don't know what I was going to say. I lost my train of thought. Whatever. So... I don't think there is another boss here. But the game might surprise me. I'm more interested about the items. But again, this area looks pretty unchanged. I, I'm just trying to think of places that I've like not explored yet. Uh, obviously, what the fuck? Obviously, we haven't gone to Gwendolyn, and I'm pretty sure we can go to Gwendolyn now. Okay, this is not. Did I already pick that up? Strange. So yeah, we can go to Gwendolyn now. If the mechanics are the same. It could very well be that there's just nothing here. Uh, no Black Knights. Speaking of, you know, I'm, I'm just trying to think back. Did we even encounter a single Black Knight? Throughout this playthrough? Because I don't think we actually did. And what else have I not done? Oh, I haven't been to the depths, right? We haven't fought Gaping Dragon. Oh, that's probably something that's like way... Way in the past, you know, like kind of pointless to do. Okay, they do have an item here. They do have an item there as well. Yeah, there's like legit... Oh, fuck. It's locked. What is it? Lock has been changed. Yeah, eat shit, bitch. There's like fucking teleported enemies here. That's pretty good, though. I gotta give it up. Well, fuck it, we'll go down now. So what actually happened here? I think the stray demon or whatever fell through the floor. Or something like, why are you on it? Oh, it's just been one of those days. Um, you know where you yawn a lot? It's just that type of weather, you know, it was humid. What the fuck? Why is the fog gate engaged? Oh, hello. Okay, you're here. Asylum Tyrant. Let's see if he's just renamed or... There's something going on. I think he's just renamed. Um... Yeah, it's like super humid. But it's... Also kind of cloudy. And... You know, like, you know one of those days. Where it's just like... You feel tired. Can, can I not hit this guy? Okay, so the only gimmick here is that they spawn... 
fuck that attack. That attack can like really like fucking frame trap you or some shit. To use fighting game terminology. Cause but there's kind of pointless, he just he just keeps killing the ads. They don't pose that much of a challenge. Okay, he's dead. Fairly easy. But I am fairly sure I am OP for this. Does he still drop? Only oh, drops a red tie, nice lab. Am I stoned or did he drop his soul as well? Maybe not. Maybe I was stoned. This should better be the key to the cell. Ring of Temptation. It's not the key to the cell. Don't tempt me. Wait, did he drop a key? He seemed to have dropped something, right? Yup. A phallic rune. The soul of a blind wizard. A phallic rune? What the fuck is that? These runes I don't get. Uh, somebody more enlightened will need to, like, inform me on what the fuck these do. Runic weapons. This is like a new upgrade path. I didn't even fuck with that. Oh well. You know what the issue is though now? I know what the issue is. The issue is... We gotta go to the fucking... What's it called? Lost Isolith. Where is the... Is it the nursery, I think? I think that's the closest bonfire, because we're done with all the other Lord Souls. I mean, Bed of Chaos is the only one that remains, which I kind of stopped because... It's like a, they made this area more annoying. I mean, they put the boss, the Centipede Demon, which is already a boss I dislike. In the middle of like the big open Isolith arena, if you remember. And that ain't it, Chief. I'll just tell you that much. That ain't it. Speaking of phrases that died out, that ain't it is one of them. <laughs> so I'm really hoping. that the fact that I only had a plus 10 weapon then and I was way more under leveled had an impact on how this area went I sure do, do hope so and if I remember correctly there ain't even a bonfire right or at least I didn't encounter a bonfire Yeah, because I'm sure he still drops the orange ring. I really hope he still drops the orange ring because otherwise we are going to be in trouble. Dip your foot in the... This straight up looks like fucking Rayman 2 lava. Man, I gotta play Rayman 2 one of these days. It is probably one of my favorite games of all time. It might be my favorite game of all time. Uh, Alright, bitch. Okay, this is... Uh, I mean, the effect is still there that I'm taking a shit ton of damage. But it's better. But yeah, I never played that game on the channel. So maybe, maybe. I mean, it's a quick playthrough. It would be a quick playthrough. 
few episodes. Rayman 2. Just for fun. Or I could stream it one of these days. I don't know. Okay. I'm trying not to. Oh god, this is such bullshit. This is a problem. Like You get to this boss and all your Estus is gone. I cannot fucking believe it. Like they they've got to be kidding me with this. Like Like who thought removing the bonfire? <sighs> People who were around on my Dark Souls 2 stream, which by the way, I'm streaming Dark Souls 2 over on Twitch. Got to be resuming Saturday. Um, people who were there got a little um, preview of my feelings on this overall, like overall feelings on this mod. Um, but people who are watching here, um, you guys will have to wait. Oh fuck, no. Until I'm done, but... I will tell you that much, it's a lot less positive now than when I started this mod. You know, all the changes at the start can kind of overwhelm you. And you're like, whoa, this is holy shit, and this, and this is different, and this is different. Hey, there's new bosses. Uh, now, I don't know how many hours in, uh, my feelings are... Sl slightly different about this overall you know not to take away any appreciation for the work that was put in because obviously it's a lot but um i don't know i'll i'll summarize my final thoughts Later, I, I remember what I was doing differently. That I, I put on the gold handset, which has pretty good fire defense. And that's how I made it through. Yeah, that's the key. Which is a little bit weird because your feet are actually exposed. It's a, they're exposed to all the perverts who want to see your feet. Which is a little bit strange in the lava, but whatever. You know, game logic. Cool. And of course we still gotta be the centipede demon. That is not not out of the equation, you know. Ah, oh, this is gonna be such bullshit. Mm. That, that attack though. Oh fuck this boss. Again, I dislike this boss normally as well, mainly because of that attack, which he has a real habit of spamming and you cannot get up quickly from that attack and he just keeps spamming it 
I mean, what is even going on? Okay, finally I got close to him. Nice. Okay, I gotta like lure him. S what? <laughs> oh, so the grab. This doesn't deal a lot of damage. Yeah, it doesn't. It actually put me close to him. Oh, he's difficult to hit. But this is way easier with a plus 15 weapon. Okay, now I can... I can range him. Actually, I can't range him because he's not... Okay, fuck you. Ah, <sighs> finally. After being trashed around with in the previous attempt, and even the, in this attempt, I felt pretty good. And we finally have it. We have the orange charred ring, which is really good. The question is, where is the entrance to that bonfire? Oh yeah, it's not here. That means I can put back on my normal set which is not the most exciting armor in the world but whatever sometimes you gotta go for simple right how long have I been going okay we're still good Man, this is so much better. But where's the fucking bonfires, though? That's the question. Like, I feel like... They should have one somewhere. I think I ran here once, right? Oh, that's when I gave up, yeah. I remember. I was running through this place. And I fucking... I think I died to some enemy. There's some new enemy here. And that's when I was like, yeah, no. That enemy, that's the one. This motherfucker. There's like some weird hollow. Some infected hollow. It's like something from Dark Souls 2. Yeah, I remember. Prost to them for making new enemies. This might have been a cut enemy though. I can imagine that. Is, did they really like model something new? I don't know. I guess it's not the most difficult. You just gotta... But yeah, this looks like... To me, this mo looks more like cut content, but maybe it isn't. I don't even know how much I would appreciate a bonfire right about now. Is there is another one here somewhere. Maybe that one is going to be... What the fuck? Are you serious? That's what this thing does? I've never had that done to me. Unbelievable. They put that here just to fuck with you. I didn't even know that thing could do that. Oh fuck, I'm sliding... 
Thanks, Dark Souls Physics. Appreciate you. Okay. Like, if I lose my weapon, I'm gonna be, like, real fucked. Um, what do I have? That's, like, usable. The fucking <laughs> hammer. <laughs> nah. Can't use none of this shit. I can use this two-handed. This might be our best option. Yeah, it's painful. Oh, please just, just put a bonfire somewhere. Another one of those fuckers. Oh, it's like here somewhere, right? Or maybe not. There's a chest here. Melted iron key. Oh. But I don't even have anything in them. Fuck off. Seriously, fuck off. Yeah, you don't like that, do you, bitch? An expert PvPer. Even though you don't take jack shit damage. Still beat you. With a plus one, a plus zero, actually. Magic, whatever. What did I get? Barbed longsword. I seriously cannot believe this is what they did to this area. Um, th this is a thousand times worse than normal isolith. Maybe I'm just a fucking idiot. Oh yeah, no, 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 no. Maybe I'm just a fucking idiot and I missed the bonfires. Okay, there's one right here. Thank fuck for that because... All right, repair, time to repair. We'll hit up everything, because probably my armory yeah, as well. We got the souls to spare. And we're going to level up like this. The question is, is it worth Kindling this place. I have three humanities, so definitely. No reason not to, really. So listen, here's the deal. I could go straight to the bed of chaos. Or we could check out the bridge. Let's check out the bridge. Because we might... We might find something on the other side. I see glowing, but that might be a crystal lizard. I mean, I like this, that there's actual enemies here. Uh, because... I honestly think this area has the worst enemies in the vanilla game. So at least they got that going. I mean, there's no point in opening this, I think. But might as well. I didn't know there was a Capra Demon on the other side who cannot get through apparently. Cool. That was not as interesting as I thought it would be. So we'll head back. We'll return. And unfortunately, 
it's bed of chaos time. You can tell by my voice probably how much I'm looking forward to doing this. Bed of chaos is everybody's absolute favorite boss. And I, I appreciate the bonfire placement though. They could have put some in between, but again, fair play that I might have missed some. I will, oh, hello. I didn't know he would be here. Because I haven't done his quest line at all. Interesting. He's gonna. No, he's not gonna disappear. It's probably gonna be some trickery. No, just keep jumping. As long as you leave me alone. And these things are so weird. Oh, and the world is... Did you see the world? It was like blank. The floor didn't render or some shit. Okay. What are they going to do with the bed of chaos? I have a feeling nothing. Okay, she's in here. Bed of chaos. And she's immune. I was just about to say, isn't she just gonna get killed? Yeah. Rip in pieces. What? Xanthus King Jeremiah. Are you kidding me? This fucking Xanthus King Jeremiah appeared. I appreciate that he was an idiot and missed. And I missed as well. What is going on? He just keeps throwing it randomly. And he cannot be... Oh, you gotta be... Fuck. Look at how much damage I've dealt to him. You wanna see pyromancy? I got Pyroman. Okay, he takes no damage from it. That's what I wanted. Oh, that is so... It's such a weird thing. Because when you think about it... It like goes against all the PvP instincts. What is he doing? Sometimes he feels like he's... Throwing it at the bed of chaos. Maybe he's trying to kill it. This is definitely some event that I didn't like follow. Because Jeremiah was in the previous boss room as well. Or where the demon fire sage should be. Cool. Crown of gold and the soul of Jeremiah. And Hume. Okay. Can I finally get around to killing the bed of chaos? I mean, this this was slightly more interesting. Now, what they could really do to this boss is remove the floor breaking mechanic. Man, I would really appreciate that. But they ain't gonna do that. Oh, they're gonna make it... Okay, that's more fair. Oh, he hits. What is he doing? I mean, this is... Okay, slightly better. Uh, but very, very slightly. Oh, shit. Okay. Do you see the effort I'm putting in here, guys? Okay. 
That is that is the most bed of chaos way to die, like ever. Okay, so Jeremiah I think is done, because we got his soul and shit. But yeah, see, I was gonna say I was putting in the extra, the extra effort to, yeah, that's weird. That's really weird. To do this properly, but it it didn't work. Is the floor gonna? Okay, it breaks away. Cool. And I think this is the easier. Oh, I hate this. That was surprisingly smooth. Cool. We'll watch this. I don't know why I'm watching this. It's little cut like the cutscene ain't the issue I'll say that much all right you know what I'm gonna do like there's no way if I can cheat I will cheat and this boss deserves to be cheated on not not in like a relationship way but you know you know what I mean the slide is insane Cool. Let me fuck up the floor. Did I get it? I got it. Okay, all we gotta do now is if he does the fire attack that we survive it. He's doing something weird. Please be the end. Of course I still get hit. If that if that had killed me, would it have counted? That's what I want to know. And he doesn't spawn a bonfire. Now that's interesting. Because the question becomes, like, how the fuck do I get out of here? Okay. This is strange. Hello? game that's really strange i feel like this is maybe a glitch like they can't this can't be an oversight right they were more careful than, careful than this it has something to do with the life soul no apparently not really strange All right then. Well, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna have to go back because my blood stain is still there. But I'm gonna do that off screen because, well, I beat the bed of chaos, and that's kind of the thing that is important. Okay, so what I'm gonna do here is I'll wrap up this episode here, and I think we're like close to the end. I'll check out some of the optional stuff, mainly going back to Gwendolyn with um the dark moon seance to see what happens there but yeah it's cool it's what we got going we might be in the final stages of this playthrough so i'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here thank you guys very much for watching hope you enjoyed this episode and i'll see all of you oh fuck it still does that 
Okay. I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.